1 John 3 verse 4 says, Everyone who practices sin also practices lawlessness, and sin is lawlessness. So far, a theme we've been looking at in this series is how Christians are children of God. As such, we are in a loving relationship with God. He is teaching and training us so that we may grow to maturity in Him. Teaching and training includes practice. We have God's instruction and Christ's example, but normally there isn't an immediate transformation into complete perfection. It takes practice. When I was 12, I got my first guitar. It was a beautiful acoustic guitar with a nice light finish on the wood so that each note just rang out and could resonate through the entire instrument. Despite its beauty and its craftsmanship, I had no idea what I was doing and sounded awful. <laughs> I don't claim to be any good now, but I studied how to play and I spent hours practicing so that instead of the thumb stumble stumble, stumble of a novice, I'm able to play a somewhat coherent song. This verse describes that idea, but as a warning. We talked yesterday about fixing our hope on Christ. If we have our hope there, but are not practicing what we are learning in Christ, we deceive ourselves. The action we are looking forward to, our purification, doesn't match with what we are doing now. If we practice sin, seeing the sinful patterns in our lives and continuing in them, then we are disobeying God. I think it's rare to think, I want to be better at sinning. We're usually not that upfront about what we do and what we think. But this is, in effect, what we say when we ignore God and don't think about how we're living. We practice sinning by not actively looking to Christ in hope. Today's questions are perhaps more personal and something I definitely need to be thinking about, and so I've phrased them in the first person. Does the lawless lifestyle describe me? How am I practicing sin? Am I ignoring God's instructions and training?